Hi, Ryan, it's me. What's up? It's kind of late. Yeah, I know, but I just wanted to talk to you about something. What happened? It's about Jenny. Look, I had to tell her about everything. What? You told her about me and you? Y yeah, I know, but I had to. I, I didn't have a choice. You said we were in this together. I know, and we are, but I didn't have a choice. I had to tell her. Couldn't you have waited and told me? I know, but she's my sister. I don't need to wait for your permission. You do, and it affects me. Oh, come on. It affects me a lot more than it affects you. Oh, really? I don't want everyone knowing about this just as much as you do. Yeah, I know, but why are you being so horrible about it? This was difficult for me. Difficult for you? I've been putting up with this mess for ages. You said you didn't mind. You said it was okay. Why are you acting like this? It doesn't matter. It does matter, Ryan. I need you on my side. Look, I don't want to talk about this, okay? Wait, Ryan, wait! Ryan? Ryan? I heard that she was going out with her sister's boyfriend. Who even does that? I feel so sorry for Jenny having a sister like that. I know Taylor's mean, but I didn't realize she was that horrible. Look who decided to arrive. The lying cheat. Look, I, I can explain. Nobody wants to hear any more of your lies. I honestly expected better of you. Wait, stop! See? Now everyone knows the truth. It's not very nice, is it? But hey, that means you won't have to keep up with those lies anymore. Although I doubt anyone would believe you even if you did tell the truth. Jenny? Taylor, what are you doing here? Look, I said I didn't want to talk, okay? I know, but I need to explain. Don't you think you've done enough damage already? Look around you. There are stupid photos everywhere, and I know Sophie sent it to me. I saw the email that you tried to get me away from. I know it affects you, but it affects me too. Because every time people see those photos, they think I'm some pathetic idiot who didn't notice my sister was going out with my boyfriend. They say they're sorry and that they feel bad for me, but I know they just think I'm stupid. Jenny, you're not stupid. This is my fault. Everything is. Ryan won't even talk to me. He won't even look at me. Why did you think this would ever be a good idea, Taylor? I honestly don't know. I have no idea what was going through my head, but please listen to me now. I'm done listening to you, Taylor. Please just leave me alone. Don't make this any worse than it has to be. Jenny, wait! Please just listen to me. Please. Thanks for coming to meet me. It's fine. As long as there's free food and cake, I'll be there anytime. I'm serious. No one else will want to talk to me. Has it really been that bad? Yep. Everyone now hates me. You're the only one that's actually wanted to speak to me today. Even my mom has been acting weird. 
You don't think Jenny told her, right? I honestly don't know what to expect. I mean, I knew it would be bad, but I didn't realize it would be this bad. The whole school hates me. Jenny hates me and Ryan won't even look at me. I guess it's what I expected, but I thought at least Ryan would speak to me. Well, it is the first day. Maybe it will get easier. I mean, people forget things like this all the time. Just wait until something else happens and people will stop talking about it. Welcome to Sprinkles. Are you two guys ready to order? Oh, yeah. Can I have a triple chocolate strawberry filled cupcake with vanilla icing and marshmallows with some extra chocolate sauce on top? Oh, haha. <laughs> Very funny, Scott. He means he'll just have a normal chocolate cupcake. Okay, would you like anything? I'll just have a can of soda. Okay, I'll be back with your orders in a minute. Hey, you said you were gonna buy me something. Yeah, I meant something small, not the entire store. Ugh, fine. Look, what I really wanted to talk about was Sophie. She doesn't have anything against me now. Everyone's seen the photos. But I still have something against her, right? The fact that she's been stalking me. Look, I know what I said, but maybe this really is time just to stop. Quit while you're kinda ahead. I don't plan on this being over. Let's face it, I've got nothing left to lose. And if we could bring Sophie's laptop to the police, she could go to jail. She might not go to jail, but I guess that's an option. I know, but at least that takes the attention off of me. Okay, fine, but what if she destroyed the photos? The police have technology or something they can do to try and find it. Yeah, but I, 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 I know. One soda and chocolate cupcake? Oh, yeah, that's ours. Okay then, there you go. Uh, thanks. Okay, so what do you reckon we should do? Uh, do you mind passing me the cupcake? What? Ugh, fine. Thanks. I know I've asked you to do a lot, but please get me that laptop. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know. How did you even manage to get that on your face? I'm sorry, okay? The cupcakes are good. This is important. I still don't know what to do. I mean, I know I shouldn't sink to her level, but still, a part of me wants to do what's right. And what, sending her to jail is what's right? Ugh, no. I mean, I don't know. She stalked me and took photos of me. I'm pretty sure she deserves it. I know my sister could be pretty crazy, but usually she has a reason. Are you blaming me? I didn't want any of this. No, I'm not blaming you. I'm just saying that maybe she had a reason. A, a good reason. Okay, fine. I may have made it seem that she was lying and that no one could trust her, but... Still, she didn't need to go stalking me at my house. Look, I honestly think that it's just best to leave it. You don't want to get in an even bigger mess. Maybe it's just time to leave it alone. And besides, there's other way you can get revenge on her. Put some hot sauce in her smoothie or something. Hot sauce? I don't know, I'm just throwing out ideas, okay? Fine, but maybe you could think of some better ones while I go to the bathroom. Fine, I'll try. And get that stuff off your face by the time I get back. You're not my mom, you know. Gosh. Hey, wait, come here, okay? No one's gonna see us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but you said about your girlfriend. Yeah, but she won't know about any of this. Besides, you're the girl I really like. Wait, isn't that Sophie's boyfriend? on her. Wait, he's cheating on her. I have an idea. Oh, hey, you're back. What took you so long? You know, you were saying how there's other ways you could get revenge on Sophie? Yeah. Well, I've just found one. Oh my god, what so are you doing here? I'm so sorry. Who did do this? something was it like No, this? it wasn't me. You. You did this, didn't you? Well, it's a funny story. You see, I was at a cupcake store yesterday and I went to the bathroom and on the way there I spotted your friend 
with some other girl. And I thought, wow, that's funny. Isn't he supposed to be going out with Sophie? But then he said something along the lines of, don't worry, she'll never know. You're the girl I actually like. You're lying. That's funny because those photos say a different story. Well, you photoshopped them or something. What was it you said? Oh yeah, you can get that photo sent off and they'll be able to check if it's fake or not. And just to save you the trouble, don't worry, it's real. Why did you do this? Now the whole school thinks I'm a joke. I've been telling everyone that he's my boyfriend and now everyone thinks I'm a liar. It sure does suck, doesn't it, when people take photos that you don't want other people to see and decide to print them out and show the whole school. It really is so annoying. Why would you do this? Are you just doing it for more attention? Oh no, I just saw the opportunity and thought it would be a great chance to get back at you. Considering I didn't know you decided to ruin everything for me. And don't worry, there's more of where that came from. Sweet revenge. It's such a fun thing. So if I were you, Sophie, I would make sure you make no more mistakes. And besides, I've got nothing left to lose. You're not gonna get away with this! Well, you know what this means. What? What does it mean? Sophie, I really don't think it would be a good idea to get involved. Oh, it's too late for that. This is war.